It's cold up here, yeah. Each one cheek getting around there. Ah. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> What's wrong? Hmm? <laughs> Good morning. Mm. It is our first day in New Hampshire. And we got up this morning and it was what, 45 degrees in our camper. Yeah, that's why mm. we're all bundled up. Little faces and our bodies. <laughs> so, what happened was, what had happened was, our uh, battery went dead. So, got out there, fired up the generator, which I really didn't need to do a review on. And, uh, it's working out. So, we're just waiting on to get warm. I'm gonna go ride the cog on Mount Washington. Yep. That, we heard about this cog a few weeks ago when we were at Acadia Seashore. Um, our neighbor there, I can't remember his name at the moment, but that's where they were leaving to go to, to ride the cog. And um, we didn't really, I don't think you heard him talking about it. No, not, not at that point. Well, I didn't really, I mean, I wanted to come here to Mount Washington, but I didn't really want to ride the cog. But then yesterday when we saw Marissa, they have already been up here um, and they did it. And she was talking about how great it was. Mm -hmm. And Michael heard her talking about it. And then she said, it's really expensive. And I was like, oh, it's out. We're not doing it. So I looked it up to see how much it was, and I was like, uh, no, we're not doing that. And Michael said, well, I've always wanted to ride a car. Yeah. So. They got a few of them in Alaska, so. Yeah, this one was the first one ever, the first cog to go up a mountain hmm. ever. So. Oh, mm -hmm. And we, we went last night and got our tickets, and, um, we thought we were getting tickets for the steam steam one, but we didn't. Instead, we got biodiesel. You yeah. got biodiesel? Yeah. Talk about it. Yeah. I, she didn't even ask us when we were buying the tickets which one we wanted, and we didn't think to say steam. So, we're just going to go ahead and go with it and do what we paid for. So, it'll be fun anyway. Maybe we can get a Now it's time for coffee. Yep. Hey, Homer, here's your ski, um, pan. Ski pan. Homer, here's your ski pan. There's no one. And these are... This is... Okay. Alright, so... <clears throat> after we got the heat going... Here comes the car. So I probably should pull over. After we got the heat going, um, this morning we... Um, got ready to go on the Mount Washington Cock. So now we are headed up the dirt road, passing cars. <laughs> Had to pull over because we're staying. Have you told them where we're staying? So we're staying on public land. This is the national park. Yeah, the national forest. So on a dirt road. Jefferson Notch. So, which is really cool because one end comes right out near, you just take a left and go up the mountain and you're there. So, at Mount, yeah, at the Cog, at Mount Washington. So, that's where we're headed this morning. Uh, we got generator fired up this morning, got some heat going. And it's, yeah, last night, well, last night, yesterday afternoon when we was up there, it was 17 degrees on top of the mountain. So that's why we're dressed like this. We're all ready to go. And uh, all the kids are ready to go in their ski stuff. <laughs> all warm, so. So anyway, so we'll show you Mount Washington, what it looks like, and hopefully have fun riding the car. Way up there in the clouds, but 
they have high winds, so <clears throat> we're supposed to go up at 10:30. And they said they're delaying everybody because they have three carloads of people up there. And they're trying to get them back down safe. So you don't want to act evacuation. Yeah. So if um, we get to go in an hour, we're only going to get to go. 5,200 feet if the winds don't slow down. So. Instead of all the way to the top. Just 6,200, yeah. There's a mountain we're going to. So, you see that white? That, um, no, we're going to this one. Anyway, all right, we'll let y'all know how it goes. So we went inside and um, walked around, but there's so many people in there. And we're dressed for like 30 below. So we just came back outside. We're just going to wait out here. We were super hot and crowded in there. I think that's the steam train. That's the steam train. Can I go see it? Watch out, sit by a window. <laughs> Walking the wind trail over here. 
So we were prepared to get out. Usually you can get out and stay up in the top for an hour, um, but the winds are so bad today. The guy here on the train said it will blow the children away. So we really don't want to blow our children away. So we only got to sit here for about, I don't know, maybe 10 minutes. And everybody tried to get out on the platform and see. Flippers. Yeah, we had flippers. But now we're facing the other way. Yeah, get ready to go downhill. Down. We're all leaned back in the seat. Ready to go down? I should be able to make it out. telling somebody else that you get a refund if you don't get to go all the way to the top so that's good to know um, if you get here and you can't go all the way up they do refund you because uh, we really lost a lot of time yeah we lost like a whole hour almost and um, what were your thoughts about it do you like it yeah it was fun we somebody one of the trains was having a little trouble so it took us a little longer so we got a little we did a lot of waiting to get down and the kids like you hear like a, so. everybody was done a long time ago so <laughs> we're gonna go find some lunch hey, well there's a tail real close by Our guide on the cog told us about a lot of things to do in the area and this behind me is the Grand Hotel at Mount Washington so we thought that sounded like a neat thing to check out there's ballrooms and when we drove in there was horses London was really excited about that so we're gonna go in and check it out The gold ring. There must be a lot of gold in it. Gold, 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 gold,
So we are in the cave in the bottom of Mount Washington. Uh, what's this place? Grand Hotel. Grand Hotel. And it's a bar at nighttime. But right now it's closed. And it's pretty cool. This place looks really old. So like that was built into the bedrock? Yeah, this is built into the bedrock of the actual hotel. So they opened these gates up. And, and it's a bar at night. But anyway, it's uh, pretty cool. It's, it's really cool. Fancy. Like it's literally cool down here. Yeah. The rest of the hotel we're burning up hot, but <laughs> it feels pretty. Good. Feels good. We're the only ones down here. Us right. and our five kids, of course. Yeah, and they're hungry, and we're hungry, so we still haven't had lunch. So we've got to meander on out of here and go get some food. We've got to see this fancy hotel. All right. Yes, that's cool. What is that? So we just ate lunch, um, and I think this Here. is Camden, yeah. and it is Twin Mountain Trading Post and Catalano's Main Street Pizzeria. Pizzeria. Anyway, it's really good. The pepperoni is awesome. Um, so it's cheese. And anyway, we just want to tell y'all about it. So if you come up this way, it's a good place to eat. It's yeah. right on the highway, yeah. so we didn't have to drive far. It was like the first place to come to, and everybody's hungry. They're like, stop here, stop here. Yeah, like, okay. <laughs> the kids want a picture of this. No, I don't think you can get on. It looks like don't like mess with a Come here. Get side on it. Ooh, well, it was a fun day. We rode the car, ate some pizza, rode around, looked for Junior Ranger stuff. 
<laughs> books. I never found a place to find the Junior Ranger books. Oh well. <laughs> but uh, we still had fun, though. We uh, really had fun on the cog. Didn't get, get to go all the way to the top, but that's okay. Um, if you're in New Hampshire and you want to go do something cool, and if something fun to do, it's kind of pricey. It's, it's kind of really a, pricey. But it's kind of a one-time thing, so you know what I mean. It's not like we're gonna do it again. So yeah. Even anyway. if you don't want to do that, just coming up here to the, um, I think it's called the White Mountain National Forest. Mm -hmm. yep. It's beautiful. Um, the mountain ranges here are just gorgeous. And right now, this time of year, the leaves yeah. are all changing. It's October the 6th, so, oh, so yeah, pretty. the leaves are like perfect. Yeah, we love <laughs> it. So it's it was definitely worth coming to New Hampshire we didn't know how long we would stay, but it's Probably. cold. Roll out tomorrow. Yeah, yeah, it's cold, and we want to go see people, so <laughs> we're going to meet our <laughs> new friends that we met at the mall in Portland. We're going to meet them in Vermont tomorrow. Hang out for a little while. So. Yeah, for a couple of days with them, so. So but that'll be fun. fun, yeah. Yeah. We'll have full hookups, too, so. <laughs> Be nice. Yeah, well, we kind of agreed that if we did the cog, we would do boondocking for a while to kind of pay for that. So Well, we will. We will after we spend yeah. a couple days we get with our, our friends. Back. So, yeah, we do get a little refund. London said we get our money back. We get part <laughs> of a refund. For not getting to go to the top. Yeah, yeah, we don't even know how much refund that'll be. So, but hey, it'll be something. So. Yeah. Hey, I'll take it. Yeah, $25. That's $25 I ain't gonna work for. Dang. What about one? I need tires. Yeah. $1? Yeah, I'll take $1. Oh, maybe a yeah. penny. What about a penny? Hey, I want about half a penny. Anyway. <laughs> Let's see. The kids have Legos out all over the floor. Lakota's playing Play Doh, her favorite thing. Why did it get so dark? This one. That's better. Yeah. My face is like the light is like a It's your hat. Mm -hmm. Go to the um. <laughs> All right. So anyway, it's, so it's bedtime. We're tired. Very I think tired. we say that every video. We're That's tired. because we're always tired and it's always bedtime. Oh god. There it goes again. Okay. All right. Well, hey, we'll see y'all later in Vermont.